guys so today i'm gonna be making some cookies this is just from trader joe's gluten-free vegan baking mix i got it from carrie when she went to the mainland she bought this for me okay items that i will be needing is melted salted butter or vegetable oil vanilla extract three wow okay that's not too much okay so let's just get started let me just read this here the carbs are kind of low like but it's still carbs there's total sugars is six and added sugars are six more it has almond flour coconut sugar semi-sweet chocolate chips this is not keto but it is vegan we're just gonna go ahead and taste it cook it and see how it is it's good because it does, it's gluten-free so let's just try that i wonder let's see so it comes like this it does you can tell it's like almond flour I'll just be using some virgin olive oil because I don't have no vegetable oil or some butter. I ran out of butter. So let's use that. So that is three tablespoons. That's a lot of oil. One. So I only got some regular, um, some almond milk. So that's what I'm going to be using. That is going to be three tablespoons as well. this and that will be two teaspoons of the vanilla extract. Teaspoons. Alrighty guys so I'm just using a little fork. I seen one of my YouTube friends eating cookies so now I'm here cooking baking this cookie. Um, guys, don't forget that I do have a giveaway going on. Um, I'll link the channel in the description or down below in the comment section. And the rules are on there. And don't forget to follow them if you want to win. And then on December 25th or 24th, I'll reach out to the winners. Um, I, I won't post it on here. I'll just get a hold of them because it's way easier. So just gotta follow the rules on that one and I only noticed that there's only two people actually following but they're not following I guess if nobody's gonna participate then there's no sense in making any giveaways <laughs> but you know we'll see so all I got is this little cookie sheet thingy but it doesn't it's not gonna take much anyway I'm just gonna put it in here and then scoop it okay but me i didn't know that i'm not supposed to put the milk all at one time i add one tablespoon at a time as needed see that's one thing about me i don't read through thoroughly okay so 
I don't have parchment lined or I grease the pan uh, for 10 minutes or until lightly brown. Okay, let's go and get that started. I'm not much of a baker, so that's why I don't have all those kind of stuff. Then I'm going to be cooking these for 10 minutes. Okay. It's time to go in. Hello, hi beautiful. Hi my poop bear. The bear is trying to, you hear her sniffing? She's like trying to smell it. Yes, ma'am. Sorry, you can't eat that. Okay. Sorry, you can't eat that, mama. She wants to eat it, but poor good girl. I'm going to give her her own treat. But here it is, guys. I'm going to go have milk and cookies now. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Gave her, I'm giving her her own treat, the little biscuit. I wonder if she thinks it's a cookie. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in our next video. Bye, love you guys. It does taste really good with, even though it's almond, almond flour, it, it's really good. Mm -hmm. Of course, you need milk, right? Cheers.